Hello, in this video today we will explain more how to use the default action in automation. First of all, when you come to automation, on the left hand side you will see different types of tools. So in default action, it is how you trigger the auto reply. Basically, uh, if you have used email before, you know that you can set out of office message and whenever someone sends an email to you, there will be an auto reply saying that you, you're out of office. Same case here on WhatsApp, you can simply set your working hour on for your number and you can start to enable different types of messages. For example, if it's not office hour, then you can reply your uh, working hour to your client so to give them an idea of uh, your working hour. And you can also enable different functions as well. For example, if there's no one online, you can send them uh, like a message on um, like no one's is online and maybe we'll attend to your message later on or if there's no uh, keyword matched it in the keyword action say your client didn't send any words to you they send a stickers they send emoji or uh, send an image to you then you can trigger this one uh, even if there's no keyword match there will be a welcome message and apart from that during office hour if the user wait more than a certain minute that you can configure here then uh, you can also uh, reply them with um, the following message. So say that um, your customer support will get back to you as soon as possible to keep the client uh, warm and also not to just leave them there waiting. And you can also send fallback messages. And uh, if the chat is not uh, soft, then you can also um, send a client a message if, to see if they still need any help. So all this message right here, you can um, configure the reply material and select the corresponding material for your client based on different actions that are suitable for your case. You can choose which one to enable by just simply clicking it and select the material to send to your client. So it will be super easy. You just need to save the setting to trigger the auto reply based on different situations. Thank you.